introduction of a narrative essay is different from other essays because it sets up the story and hooks the reader right from the start. There are no rules with a narrative introduction, and you may have an introduction that answers the prompt, but it doesn't have to be a formal thesis unless your teacher or professor asks for one. Be creative. Here are some ideas. Start with a flashback, something that happened when you were young. Start with an internal monologue. What was going through your mind? You might want to start with the climax or the high point of your story. Or you may start by describing the setting, the time and place. If there's a conflict, describe it in the first sentence. Or you might want to start with dialogue between you and someone else. Start with a startling fact or statement. Or start by describing an event in progress. Or combinations of any of the above. You could start by reading a letter or note you found or saved from the past. You could start with a prologue, background information that tells of events from the past that set up the story. In academic writing, we end our essays with a conclusion. And the conclusion typically sums up or wraps up the essay. But with the narrative, the story that you are telling actually comes to an end, so a lot of details need to be wrapped up. In general, the conclusion of a narrative will reveal the end of a conflict. It may also reveal a lesson learned or an insight gained by you or the characters from the experience. The ending of a narrative is your opportunity to leave your reader understanding his or her own life lesson as well through your eyes. Here are some more ideas for your conclusion. End with your feelings about the event. For example, end with a prediction or advice. You can end with a summary statement. Or you might want to end with the famous quotation, end with what was learned through the experience. You might want to end with a celebration or a realization, what was gained or what was lost. Another technique is to consider the following ending helpers. You won't use these actual words in your writing. Rather, just think them before you write the answer. How would you or your main character respond if you or he or she were to say, I never realized that. I discovered that. I have learned that. I now know that. I want my reader to understand that. Sometimes a writer must try out several endings to see which one works best. Be patient. The ending will come. The beginning of your narrative should hook the reader, and the ending of your narrative essay should leave the reader thinking, wow, that was a great story. Keep reading and writing.